Hey guys. Oh man, can you believe it's already January 2021? Anyway, I got two bags on the same day. And what was weird is I had to update my payment method. So I was hella worried about everything being delayed. So I'm trying to decide. I know for sure there should be an eyeshadow palette in the boxy charm. So I decided to go with this one because I'm almost certain there wasn't any eyeshadow. It's late and I wanted to try and match and be festive. I know it's kind of goofy, but it is. I'm pretty sure this is it's either dream big, dream something on, dream on. Anyway, that's the theme. This is the, the bag, and of course, I am going to be showing you a brush set. Um, and it's the Laura's brush set. I must have pre-rate on these guys. They're like $120, I think, or $160. They're absolutely insane. And if I'm not mistaken, this... Um, style in particular is the midnight blue so i will be showing you guys those but look at this is exciting it was actually a little bit heavier than i thought it was going to be and i remember i did have an add-on so there's there's also that but let me see there's a couple you guys did see that right of course they're promoting the glam bag x i'm really not sure i I mean, it says it has a good value, but I mean, we see these same values for $50. And if I'm not mistaken, they're going to be $60 because it's $30 on top of what you already pay for your existing Glam Bag Plus six subscription. However, they did not uh, specify in particular if you did not have a subscription at all, what this would be off the bat. So that... That is a little interesting to me. At first, I was really worried because I've never heard of this Patrick Top person. I was like, why is it going to be all Patrick Tasted? But there's only a couple things. But as far as I know, this is like one bag. I don't think there's a like many variations. I don't like just as eight full-size products. Well, I guess you choose three. So maybe that's the the difference here. I don't know. I hear it, I know IGK is great because I have their balm stuff up there, but anyway, moving along. Um, oh, yep, Dream It is the January 2021. Of course, we don't get our insert card. Anyway, okay, so apparently they want to be horoscopians. I am on the cusp of a Libra. There is something in my eye, so I keep rubbing it, sorry. Um, beauty resolutions for your sign. I'm on the cusp, Virgo Libra, so it says stray from the understated looks you love and exper experiment. See, I always go bold, so what is that supposed to mean? I don't even need to go bolder. Shoot. Okay. Libra, go with the flow and let your looks change with your moods. I'm trying. I'm trying. Get to know your glam bag plus valued at 120. Yeah, this one, one <laughs> uh, product I'm pretty sure is valued at that, so that's pretty intense. Um, anyway... I hope you guys are having a great, great Sunday, Saturday. I think this is going to be uploaded and it will be a Sunday, so. This was bigger than I thought it was going to be, and I'm pretty sure they chose it for me. Yeah, this was one of their choice items. Um, I chose the brushes and the moisturizer and something else I can't even remember now. Isn't that funny? Hey, it gives me more of a, hey. And when I saw that they, they chose this for me because it has a tool, a tweezer, and a scissors, I thought, well, the, we need more scissors. And we always could use better tweezers, so I feel like this was a really good thing. <laughs> and it came looking like this. Um, I did a photo shoot today. It was super duper fun. Billion Dollar Brows is a really great brand. Um, I really wish it was like a metal eyelash, like straightener, but I'm pretty sure there is a hair poking me, but this little brush right here is amazing, like super soft, billion dollar brows is all over it, um, just, I can't believe they can even tell you that it's an eyeshadow brush and they have their B&B &B all over the place. 
I'm just going to use this to try and get some hairs out. Yeah, there's got to be something going on. Feels better though. So it works. <laughs> anyway, moving on. So these are really nice metal. Come together with a really nice point. So they should actually work good. Sturdy. And the little scissors. They actually seem pretty good. I like that. The billion dollar brows is all over them. Wow. And... Yeah, yeah. Don't know what the MSRP rate on these. I'm pretty sure it's outstanding. It's like twenty something dollars. Oh wow, I forgot the little plastic thingy. So this covers the um, scissors. How nice is that? Bum bum. Okay. Moving on. This was my add-on. So this was three dollars, and I was a Dingleberry, and instead of buying them on both of my little accounts for six bucks and having these and two times the amount. I went to Nordstrom Rack. I don't know if you guys know about that store. And I bought one of these masks for $3 and I could have gotten two of them for three. So I should have just waited. Should have just waited. But I'm really excited because I have gotten these in a past glam bag. They feel great. And I don't know about these particular ones. But I'm really excited to use them. I actually have one sitting in my bed right now. Uh, Centella Repairing Mask. Solutions for sensitive dry skin, mild irritation, and skin breakouts. Um, and this one's a nutritious. So this is strength and this is nutritious. Uh, shea Butter Nourishing Mask. Uh, extremely dry skin, oil, moisture imbalance, and uneven skin texture. I don't know. Maybe... I don't know, I'm, they, they both say to leave on for only 15 minutes, so I wonder, because some of them, they, they say to leave on for like a half hour, or for a while, or whatever, you know. Um, this was another product they picked for me, which was actually, I know they sell this at Target, and, and you can get it everywhere. Um, oh, cool. They never come like this. Is this glass? Kind of sounds like it. It's kind of off-placed. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be. Or if you can replace it. That's weird, huh? That's really odd. Anyway, gonna just straighten that out a little. <coughs> and then this is the bottle. Isn't that rad? Skin Treats Hydrating Milky Serum Revitalizing Skin Boost. So I... <laughs> it was the most miracle blessed thing that happened along the Ipsy thing. Um... I think something spilled all over the place it was like a oil and in a replacement because they couldn't give me the same oil back they gave me this amazing like $60 serum from bio race and I don't know if you guys can see how much is left there's like barely anything left no it's super sad because I'm like what am I gonna use now I mean I have this little sample serum it's almost gone too but <clears throat> now I have a serum and I'm super excited although this is actually affordable an affordable brand. It's not no sixty dollars serum. It's probably like a fifteen to twenty dollars serum. Um, not sure of the thickness of this baby. Smells good though. I don't want to open it yet because I'm not completely out though. Oh, maybe it has a cap on it. Yo, that's amazing. It has a little cork on it. <laughs> As I spill it all over the place, right? Okay, so it has this little cap thing but I can still smell the product underneath it. it smells refreshing and nice I don't even know how it looks like it everything's been reminding me of like roses lately so I'm gonna have to I'll let my man smell that and tell me if that's actually rose and I'll put it in the details if it's actually rose scented or what is going on there but it's actually really nice because it's sealed you don't have to open it. Nothing's going on there. So that's awesome. It says it lasts only six months. What the heck? Pretty sure this says 12. If not longer. Yeah, 12. Double the amount of time though. What the heck? Six months? That's quick. I wonder about that sometimes. It's like, why is that going so quickly? This one doesn't even have an expiration date, does it? The heck? So yeah, it's like 
Use it till you're it's gone. You ain't gonna use it for very long. Well, I use stuff for a long time. Maybe six months, okay. Well maybe use it generously. Well it smells great. It's really refreshing and nice, so milky serums are nice. Rose hip. Rose hip oil. Moisturizing superfood. Jojoba seed oil. Hydrates and nourishes. Aloe vera. Soothes dry skin. How do you like them apples? Cool. Okay, I'm excited. All right, so we got my add-on and three down, two to go. All right. Oh, this I picked. This seemed really awesome. This is bigger than I thought it was going to be. So I've gotten this. This is actually sitting right here. Haha, <laughs> how convenient. No, not that. Sorry, I gotta get all close to you guys. Okay, so this is Skin Iceland. Really yummy stuff. And it's a lip fix. So this is the limited edition Berry Lip Fix Solutions for Stressed Skin. So when I saw this, I was like, yeah, Skin Iceland. Oh yeah, <laughs> we're getting that. Solutions for Stressed Skin. Minty Lip Fix. So same thing, but you guys are going to see the huge difference in size, because obviously that's a sample. This is huge. That's what she said. I'm going to kick your butt. I'm going to kick his butt. Okay, see that? Mm. Or they revamped and thought, well, maybe we should give them more. I don't know. This is great. Oh my gosh. Super, super duper awesome. This is super great. Well, it doesn't say limited edition, but minty lip fix sounds great. So I'm trying. Oh. Uh, I just think I'm actually getting the pepperminty yumminess already. I don't know if this is frozen or what. Yeah, it's all thick. Huh. <laughs> yeah, and as far as I know, this stuff isn't overly cheap either. Not that I pick stuff just solely for their price, but sometimes I do, because if I can't pick anything I really like, I'm just going to be like, well, what's something that's super expensive I'm not going to treat myself to ever, you know? Like, super expensive lip stuff. Shoot, I always got my lip stuff from my dentist, and it was free. Don't know about you guys, I'm blessed, I don't know. Maybe you guys didn't have dentists. Maybe you guys didn't have free lip gloss. I don't know. Either way. Okay. <laughs> Pervice is my brand. When I saw this, I was very happy because it wasn't a cleanser because they've given me so many. But I love Pervice. I will take a cleanser every day, all day. So when they let me pick this, I was super... I think this... See, I thought I have tried this. And I think I already, like, used all of it already because this is a balancing moisturizer and they look so similar <laughs> it's horrible <laughs> there was a different thing that had like SPF in it and it was not very happy with my skin like my skin did not agree with it oh it's sealed okay well until I need a moisturizer I'm not gonna open this baby I wanted to smell it but I know how good this stuff works and smells so I have faith in it and I know it costs like $45 so that's another thing but it says oily combination, normal, even sensitive skin. So hydrates, balances, prevents fine lines, and preps skin for makeup. All around me is pearlies. See, this is even a balancing moisturizer. It is antioxidant rich priming moisturizer. And over here, we got some pearlies, watermelon, energizing aqua bomb. So all pearlies items I would definitely recommend. Highly. Um, other than that, I think that's it. Otherwise, I am just going to show you these brushes and get out of here. Okay? It says Beauty Tip keeps skin hydrated with supple and supple all winter long by infusing moisture into the air with a humidifier. Ain't that cute? That's awesome. Perfect for sensitive skin, inflammation, control, graceful aging. How do you like that? <laughs> I love, I love this. Korean beauty is amazing. I love how they say it too. Just as uh, gently smooth over the face, morning and night after cleansing for ultra nourishment. No, extra. Apply after the pearly serum. So I would love to try any pearly serum. Oh my god. I don't think I've had my hands on one. Well, actually, I have. 
Oh, and it was the Blue Lotus. Mm -hmm. That lasts for 18 months, mind you. This stuff lasts for 18 months. It's amazing. It's every one of them. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's dig into this detail. I have successfully done this before without, like, even doing a thing. Like, damage a thing. See, so... That sticky is all good out, but look at that. It opened great. Gracefully. <laughs> like that. Okay, so look at these beauties. Okay, apparently it was only... Yep, it's a five-piece set. Of Lorus. Midnight Shade something. So this is a highlighter. I don't think I have any of these brushes. I wonder if they're all freaking different. Isn't that... Is, wouldn't that just take the game? So that's what that looks like. Super soft. Anyway, yes, yummy, yummy. And I hate these little plastic sheet things. They're sucky. I can't ever seem to get them quite right the first time. Right, this one is flat shading. Me and flat shading brushes just really don't get along but this one actually looks halfway decent wow i'm gonna have to try that bitch for cut crease type you know stuff mm. yes definitely recommend it's so beautiful and soft mm. okay all right well how is every brush set different i don't understand that no they're not all different i actually have a couple repeats of loose brushes thanks to ipsy but you would think they would not do that but whatever so this is flat flat powder i wonder if that means pressed powder or if that means liquid foundation flat powder flat well maybe it's just like pack a punch powder brush like you know what i mean if you just like I have like loose pigment around here somewhere this is a little tiny bit of one but see it's a little baby see out London uh, translucent powder brush maybe that's what that's where you just pack it on with that it's actually I would use this for a foundation brush because my foundation my favorite foundation brush is was is I don't know I currently use it a lot so but it's dirty is a crown brush that I got from Ipsy and do you see how similar those brushes are and this one actually looks like it would pack a better punch than this one which is even funnier and whoa, <coughs> it looks a lot like this brush if you don't you know if you see the difference it's I mean there's longer bristles you know but this packs a big punch and you can't clean it worth a darn and it's the BoxyCharm brushes, but I really love them. Well, I won't stay in the container. But yeah, that's wonderful. That's really wonderful. Okay, so moving right around. Come on, come on. This is a great color. I got a midnight blue set of brushes. I get like really a lot of expensive, nice brushes from Ipsy. Was this a Farah brush set? But see, they're coming apart man I'm just like I don't know what the freak to do I'm worried about it anyway that sucks okay two more brushes this one is blush huh my blush brush set whatever is that oh I just had it is <laughs> this one says small contour contouring I don't even know but it seemed perfect for blush, and it always has been. It's my bingo, my go-to. You see the difference in size in those babies. This one's kind of all, like, out there for some reason. But in all reality, I feel like that might work better. Yeah, maybe. I might definitely try this, because they definitely are specific. <laughs> blush. Yeah, this is great. This is fabulous. Okay, one more, one more. They're so soft. And blue, blue, and blue. We got a bunch of blue objects. What's up with that? Even blue freaking lip tint stuff. That's hilarious. <laughs> well, whatever. Okay, this one's the tapered bell ending. Normally, 
not my biggest friend. This seems actually usable. Wonder what's up with that. Huh. I'm curious. Like what no you know with that. If it's literally just like the price difference in the brush sets from a cheap brush set to an expensive one. Like they're actually made better or what. But they haven't been perform tested yet, so we will find out. I didn't get no eyeshadows, so maybe I should just test these bad boys out with an Ipsy or a boxy trim eyeshadow tomorrow morning. Alright. Well, hope you guys have a good night. Hope you enjoyed the box. Um, I definitely did. I picked it all out, so I mean, I hope I did. But anyway, yeah. This is introducing refreshments, banish boring routines with our new membership to sparkling clean face and body essentials. Member pricing starts at $5. Okay. Clean and 100% vegan ingredients, cruelty free. So what is that about? Member pricing. Oh, maybe it's just like refreshments is one of their brands that they're going to start promoting. Gosh, there's so many. I don't understand. Exclusives for Ipsy members. Yep, I definitely think it pays to be a member of both, but sometimes you just can't afford it. This bag is pretty damn thin. I'm not happy with Ipsy for these stupid bags. But it will be used, so whatever. Hope you guys have a good night. Bye-bye. I gotta, like, turn this off now.